What's up guys, how are you guys doing today? So today guys, don't be afraid to be different, have some fun, and be yourself guys, but it is currently Saturday now, and it is actually quite cold outside, but there's a bit of darker clouds outside, the leaves are like changing colors now, I don't know if you guys can see that, but they are, and even though like our tree is kind of dead anyway, but it is only nine degrees outside, which is not great. And anyway, I work tonight at six and tomorrow at six, and they're both a closing shift. So that should be good, that should be interesting. But anyway, that's pretty much all I'm doing today. Um, since, like, I don't know, I don't really have much to do. But later in the video, I will be talking about something um, that's like happening right now and it will affect a lot of things going on and if it doesn't happen it's a good thing but if it does happen it's a bad thing but anyway that'll be later in the video and right now I'm about to go downstairs and have some lunch most likely watch Murdoch and there isn't a new episode this Monday which is a good thing because I'm at co-op at night we're doing like a debate from Four to like 10.30 and I'm also at co-op in the morning. So that should be good. I'm excited for that. We're like not in the studio. We're off shooting somewhere with like a mobile shoot which is, should be interesting. But anyway, right now I'm about to go downstairs, have some lunch and watch Murdoch. So I just got back upstairs from having lunch. I had pizza bagels and it was really, really good. But anyway, I have something to tell you guys. So it is like, it's a really long, long story and I'm about to set up a camera for you guys. So, if you guys don't already know about what is happening in Ontario schools, it's like a whole province-wide thing, and pretty much this past week, the janitors were on, um, they, they were not, like, cleaning anything, just because the, like, contract is up, and so they were they were they just didn't do anything is like they pretty much didn't do a lot this week but so our principal was like cleaning and um other stuff like that but if i find this here um if let me just find this but pretty much they if they, on Monday, which is tomorrow for you guys, but in two days for me, um, they will, they might, they might go on strike, which is not good, because their contract is up, and that means, like, we will be off school, which is not the greatest, but, anyway, so, if they go on strike, it's not even just the janitors or the custodians, it is like the secretaries and the EAs. And so pretty much what my school board tweeted was, if Cuppy or whatever, it's, I don't even know how to say it, but goes on strike on Monday, October 7th, all schools will be closed to students. As a precaution, please make alternative child care arrangements. So, if the agreement isn't reached by Monday, which I don't think it will. It'll be, I think it'll be reached by like Wednesday or something, like a couple of days, so, um, which will not be amazing because like we'll be out of school, which I won't get like co-op hours and anything. And this is also not good because the teachers contracts are also up soon and they need new contracts as well so if this keeps on going on this could be lasting for like weeks on weeks so like I don't know the whole thing is not good and 
it's terrible, but I don't know. It just happens like that, and it's all over Ontario, not just my school board, and people have been posting about it, like, it's bad, like, the schools have been trashy, and there's garbage everywhere. It's not good, but anyway, that's just, like, what is going on, and I can tell you, it is, it's not good at all, just because, like, um, oh, I went on to the website now, it says the health and safety of students and staff is the board's primary concern and responsibility. As a result, in the consultation with our board of trustees, the decision has been made to close our schools to students in the event there is a strike by QB members on Monday, October 7th. The closure will be for a duration of the strike action. If schools are closed to the students, this also means that before and after school programs early on to, on to on centers and other school based programs will not operate. However, all child care centers located in our schools will remain open with the exception of St. Rene. Okay, those are like elementary schools, I guess. As a precaution, parents are encouraged to make alternate, alternate child care arrangements since students will not be able to go to school. So it says there are no front office staff, e.g. example, school secretaries, etc. to manage safe school protocols such as confirming attendance. No educational assistant EAs, educational interveners EIs to ensure yeah, care and safety of students with special needs. No early child childhood educators, ECEs in kindergarten classrooms. No custodians to keep washrooms and fountains clean and sanitary, and manage facilities safe protocols such as fire alarms. No lunchtime supervisors to oversee. Elementary students, that one doesn't affect me, but if we are notified that a negotiated settlement was not reached on Sunday, the students cannot go to school on Monday, you will be notified via school messenger, both phone and email messages on Sunday, October 6th, or early Monday morning. Should bargaining go late into Sunday night, updates will be posted to the board website and Twitter account. As a Catholic school board, you are Catholic. YCDSB respects collective bargaining and is hopeful negotiated. Okay, so it's not good. What is going on? But anyway, so pretty much my co-op. If we go on strike, um, I've talked to my teacher and I've, my supervisor said that like. Um, you can get hours, like community service hours, and I still want to go to co-op because it's just a fun experience and it's a lot of fun. So I'm still going to co-op, and so the plan is on Monday I'm going to go to co-op because we're shooting GL in the morning, and then we have an off-site shooting on Monday night, which is the, the, a debate, so it's like 4 to 10.30, which will be, that will be exciting. And the thing is, um, it's not good if, like, I was really looking forward to be, like, doing student council this year, but if we go work to rule, that means there will be, like, no student council, no after school events, which, uh, like, I was really looking forward to doing student council this year and doing, like, videos and other stuff like that, so, like, the whole situation is terrible. But anyway, I've kind of made a little bit of a Halloween video just in case we need one if we are doing a Halloween event this year because we didn't have a meeting last week just because of how like just because of what is going on and it is already October 5th and Monday is October 7th and if we don't have a meeting then there's only like I don't even know how many more Mondays before um uh, uh, Thanksgiving, I think there's, 
after if we miss that one there's three and uh before halloween and the uh, monday the 14th is thanksgiving and then there are like we guess we'd have it on tuesday and then we'd have two more hopefully um but anyway this is like the whole situation of ontario schools and i can tell you it is not a good one So it is currently now later, it is like five-ish and uh, it's, I'm just, we just had dinner and we just had Chinese food, leftover Chinese food, but pretty much it is, the sun is more or less kind of going down and I don't know, it's, it's getting darker earlier. And so pretty much tonight I'm working at 6, so we're leaving at like 5.40 to go over to work. And then tomorrow I work at the same time, 6 to closing, which just should all be interesting. It should be good tonight, although it might be busy because like festive, festive like special is going on. We got like a big thing. We do, I believe, stuffing. I don't know. We might do pumpkin pie. I'm not sure. But that should be interesting. But anyway... Um, honestly, I'm just gonna chill for like a little bit until I have to go to work, so I'll catch you guys later. So, I just got back from work right now, and it is currently... Like, well, I got back from work, like, a while ago, but it's currently, like, 11.42. And pretty much John and I are, we watch Gotham. And I think I'm, I love, that show is really interesting, so maybe tomorrow I'll watch a couple episodes of that. And maybe that'll be, like, a new show I'm into as well. I can watch that and Murdoch, which should be interesting. Murdoch will always be my, like, number one show but gotham will be another great show if i don't want to watch like a murdoch episode and uh so there's like four seasons of gotham and they're all like 40 something minutes long and there's like 22 episodes in each season and there's a new season five but it's not on uh netflix so honestly gotham is a really interesting show but anyway it is getting late i'm about to hop into bed and then uh I don't know, or maybe just chill, but honestly, I do believe that it's going to have to end off today's video, so I would basically like to thank you guys so much for watching, and I do hope you guys enjoyed, and if you like to watch another video, guys, be subscribed to my YouTube channel, turn on my post notifications, and smash that like button. Smash. Say savage minds, peace out, I will see you guys tomorrow's video.